Watcher 2 to Cypher 9. Link established with Moss Illa Spaceport. Updating encryption protocols. And transmission secure. I assume the flight was uneventful. I arrived in one piece. What's the mission? Tatooine's a desert world. Binary star system, minimal life forms, sparsely populated by farmers and petty criminals. Moss Illa is the sole Imperial outpost. Not normally somewhere we'd expect terrorists to congregate. But these are unusual terrorists. The Ghost Cell. Unusual in what way? Methodology? Politics? Species? Methodology and function. Years ago, we heard rumors of a training program for hardened radicals. A terror cell specializing in stealth, infiltration, and assassination. Information now suggests this ghost cell is real, elite support for the Eagle's network. What are these assassins capable of? There are stories of diplomats beheaded, security teams murdered, but no proof of terrorist involvement. It's troubling. We're targeting Tatooine on the word of an anonymous source claiming to be a former ghost cell member. The source says that stopping the terrorists is a matter of conscience. He wants a face-to-face -face meeting. I'll make contact. He shouldn't be hard to turn. Profiling agrees. 74% odds. Soothe his paranoia and dispose of him when you've eliminated the cell. He's waiting for a call from a holocom terminal in town. Stay on guard. Watch it two out. for days. I don't appreciate being jerked around. Who is this anyway? Who sent you? I'm with intelligence. You don't need to know my name. Fine. No names. I'll talk about the terrorists, but I need a guarantee. If we're going to meet, no one can know. Not the ghost cell, not Imperial security. Give me your location and stay put. I can't. We each come halfway, or we don't do this at all. There are sentry droids all around town. Imperial model, but everyone knows their holocam feeds are insecure. The ghost cell could use them to find me. Take out the droids and I can make our rendezvous. Say I agree. Where do we make contact? Once we've dealt with the sentries, head to the market. Give the droids holocams to a merchant named Dr. Wiss. He'll send you to me. You'll get your safe passage. Then we talk. Smells like a sweaty farmer. Great spot for a dead drop. Good droids. Many droids. You're coming to shop now? Yes. You look around. I'm not in the market for droids, but I've got holocams to sell. Holocams? Yes, yes. For these we make an exchange. I get holocams, you get shiny mouse droid. Good condition. Thank you. I'm sure that'll do nicely. Yes, yes. Look, look, your droid is getting away. Better follow him. On Hutta, we used mouse droids for target practice. Hmm? Keep your weapons down. I don't want to fight, I just... You sure you weren't followed? I followed your instructions, and I was watching all the way. We're safe. Safe. All right. My name is Mia Hawkins. I'm not giving you the runaround. It's just... The ghost cell can look like anyone. Holographic disguise. Slow down and start again. Sure. From the beginning. I used to be part of Cobalt Flag, the anti-occupation group on Cellist. We fought the Empire, organized bombings and sabotage, didn't work. Last year, imp security cracked down. Most of us died. I was... approached by people who offered me a way out. Retraining. They were part of the ghost cell? No. Just members of the Eagles network who pointed the way. The Eagles people smuggled me into Tatooine, brought me to this weird empty village in the middle of the desert. The ghost cell lived there. A few dozen fighters from around the galaxy, training under their leader, the old man. No real name, I take it. He was ancient, brilliant. He taught us how to move unseen, kill anyone. The old man's village was an empty model. We could experiment with bombs, sniper fire, whatever. 
I spent months there. Then they started kidnapping civilians, brought them to the village so we could practice. That's when I slipped away. That's very nearly sickening. Those people were innocent. There are limits. There... The ghost cell has to stop. I don't know where the village is. They kept us sedated coming and going. But I had a thought. The cell gets food and supplies from some smuggler in town. Name of Dragon Eyes. If we can flesh him out, he can lead us there. We make noise. Dragon Eyes takes the bait. Exactly. I patched together these tracking devices. Wouldn't be hard to plant them on customers in the local cantina. People who know things. Then you ask around for Dragon Eyes, loud and public. Someone's bound to try and warn him, and with the trackers, we can see who. Believe me, I can make a scene. I'll monitor the trackers and call you when someone gets in touch with Dragon Eyes. But work fast, okay? So the Imperials come in with three astromech droids, and I'm thinking to myself... I see. You want something? I'm a little busy here. Thought I'd pay a visit. Have a drink or two. That a problem? No, most strangers have reasons for coming here, though. I've got my reasons, but I don't need them made public. You know the name Dragon Eyes. Shut up, you! Dragon Eyes. That eh, doesn't ring any bells, but that don't mean much. What's uh, this guy to you? Let's just say you're better off not knowing. Well, I'll keep an ear out, but I can't promise much. Let's ask around, see if one of these losers can find a clue. Good news. An old Rodian left the cantina a few minutes ago. Fidgety. Nervous. I'm tracking him. Might be going to Dragon Eyes. The bad news is, ghost cell assassins are all over. They're coming to kill you. Didn't expect them so soon. Yeah. Sorry. They've got stealth tech and street clothes. No way to find and fight them all. You need to get them off your back and now. Take the offensive. Draw them into an ambush. Any specific suggestions? Grab a speeder out of town. There's an old wind farm not far. Plenty of cover. And dust's good for jamming stealth. Should hide the bodies, too. Look, I have to go. They'll be looking for me. Talk later. Come out. The wind speaks your name. The sand would bury your corpse. You have asked improper questions. The old man has determined your fate. Really? Then I have a surprise for you. We shall see. <laughs> They're all dead? What did you do in here? Forget that, you're amazing. Did they hurt you? I'm alright, thank you. Let me take a look at you. They use poison sometimes. Even a scratch can be nasty. What kind of poison? Something from one of the native plants. Now can I take a look? Frankly, I'm not sure if I trust you. Not buying it, are you? Here I thought I had the details right. You're still going to die. Along with the traitor.
Hello? Still alive out there? Our perfect ambush got complicated. Still, the job's done. That's something, anyway. Now, while you were fighting, I think the Tracers got a lock on Dragon Eyes. Let's meet up before this call gets intercepted. There's a trading post near our man's location. I can make it there. If it's dangerous, I can meet you back in town. That's... No, it's okay. After what you just did, the ghost cell will be distracted at least a little. I'll wait for you in one of the storage areas. Should be safe, if you're quick. And if... I have to go. You made it, huh? I had a detonator prime just in case. I can probably turn it off now. Mia, you seem a little on edge. Sorry, sitting here while the cell's watching, relying on an Imperial to help me, it makes me restless. And it's only a matter of time. As soon as I stop being useful, I'm dead. Or in Imperial custody. Same thing. No one's going to hurt you. You have my word. Nice to hear. Even if it isn't true. Back to work. I told you I'd track down Dragon Eyes. Your trap led straight to the terrorist supplier. Real nasty sort named Milo Shvarda. He works for the local crime syndicate. Group called The Exchange. What's The Exchange's role on Tatooine? I don't know a lot about them. The Exchange runs spice, gambling, extortion, broken legs and blown up speeders. Not a shock their guys connected to the ghost cell. Milos must get supplies through Masilla and ship them to the village. We need to know how he does it. I'll pay him a visit. I'm sure he has Exchange protection. But his house isn't far. Afterwards we can meet back here. Oh, I... I didn't hear anyone come in. The guards usually call. If you had an appointment, you should know. My husband is out on business. He'll be back soon. I need to talk to him. If it's no trouble, I'd rather not have to come back. I'm not sure. No one said anything about a visitor. Who are you, anyway? What do you want here? Don't worry. Your husband and I go way back. I wanted to surprise him. That right. He's not big on surprises, but I suppose you know that. Well, I was about to fix lunch. Care to join me? That sounds wonderful. We can swap stories about Milos. Oh, I'm sure you have quite a few. Stars know I do. Isbet, I'm back! Who is this? What are you doing here? Don't be rude, Milos. I was just telling your friend about the time you sold the farm. This is not my friend, and things are very dangerous for us now. You and I are going to have a talk. What does she mean? What's this all about? Shut up. Just... just stay calm. You were the one asking questions. I was promised you wouldn't survive. Who told you I wouldn't survive? How do you know someone would come after me? They're always watching. As soon as I heard, they heard too. The ghost cell came to me. They offered the exchange protection. Assassins. If we gave them what they needed. What could I say? They're worse than we are. And now you think you frightened me? We can come to an arrangement, Milos. All I want is to find their village. You're joking. What kind of arrangement? The terrorists won't let you live after this. So you need me to stop them. Blackmail. But I see your point. I get their supplies. My men bring the crates to a drop point in the canyons. From there, the ghost cell brings the supplies home by speeder. The next delivery is soon. Beyond that... I know nothing. This is the right thing to do. I understand. I will... I will not cause difficulties. Come, Isbet. Let's get away from here. Hello. I'm recording this message for you. Funny thing is, I don't know your name. By now you've talked to Milos. I hope he gave you what you need to find the village, because I've done all I can. Even sent everything I know about the Eagle's network to intelligence. But now I'm leaving, because I know how this ends. After the ghost cell is neutralized, you turn me in. I like you, but I can't trust you. You're an Imperial, and I'm a terrorist. Anyway, destroy the village. Kill the old man. They're not part of the Resistance. There's something evil. I used to blow things up too, but I don't get self-righteous about it. 
Anyway, what now? We're down by one. We go to the exchange drop point and find the terrorist village. Same as before. Works for me. Let's get going. Well, there's stuff here. Guess the ghost cell hasn't picked up its delivery. There's plenty of room inside these things. Guess where we're going. Worst part is, I've traveled this way before. Welcome, my child. I wondered whether you'd find your way. I'm so sorry. I couldn't stop them. I applauded you toward the end. You've trampled my garden, of course. But I admire your skills. The old man. You trained the ghost cell. Indeed. So many students in this day and age. It's rewarding work. Be careful. He'll kill you. Don't mind your friend. We found her in the spaceport and thought we'd bring her home. We could have killed her, of course. But what reward would that be when she's served so well? She's not your problem. This is between us. And I have no intention of harming her. The truth is, I let me a defect. From the moment she began training, I saw that she was weak, unworthy. I knew she would flee and turn on us. She was the perfect bait to lure an Imperial Intelligence Cipher. If you really wanted to meet a Cipher, you should have come to Drummond Cast. Alas, I cannot trust Imperial hospitality. We've been watching you. Learning your techniques. In Mosila, at the wind farm, in exchange territory, sinking our emotions with yours. You're fantastically talented. You'll show us everything, and then we'll replace you inside your own organization. Imperial intelligence won't be deceived that easily. A cipher's existence is a lie. Any mistakes will be dismissed as... Psychological instability. Of course, we'd rather have captured you before you killed so many. But all in all, I'd call the plan a success. All that's left is your defeat and subjugation. The eagle will triumph. You don't... You don't know what you're doing. You don't know how many lies are at work. No idea what's really going on. You'll have plenty of time to explain in your cell. No. I will not be taken. Poison. <laughs> it's really him. He's really dead. I'm sorry about everything. I didn't know what he was planning. I can't believe he used me. There was no way you could have known. Besides, it's over. And I'm grateful for that. So, what happens now? The cell is gone, but we're both here. I am in no shape to fight. Let's say it was your choice. 
Tell me what you do. Seriously? All I want is my freedom. Part of me wants to stick around. You seem like good people, but I can't. You know? I won't try to change your mind. Make a life for yourself somewhere new. I... Thank you. I won't forget this. Goodbye. Try to remember. The other side isn't all bad. I'm not gonna ask. Let's just not tell your bosses. We done? Mia helped us. I wasn't going to kill her for that. What did I say about not asking? Come on. Might as well report back at the ship. Secure transmission established. This is Watcher 2. Your efforts to destabilize the terror network are working better than expected, Cypher. Unfortunately, I don't have good news. We attempted to capture the Eagle in a raid on Tholaton. We found a base, but the man had moved on. Is there a trail we can follow? No. I'm still hopeful your efforts will draw him into the open. We've also been researching the so-called eradicator devices. They're satellites, orbital strike weapons with enough firepower to level a city. Here's the bizarre thing. The terrorists aren't building the eradicators, they're growing them. What do you mean, growing? The eradicators are a combination of biological and mechanical components, organic batteries in a weaponized shell. The terrorists don't need factories anymore. They can grow eradicators wherever there's room. Do we know when the terrorists plan to attack? Not tomorrow, but soon. For now, we'll continue gathering information. You have your own mission. Destroy the cells and they'll lead us to the Eagle. Watcher 2 out. <laughs>